It's time for episode number two, in which we will show you how to display a warning message if the marker is outside of the selected area. The previous episode showed you how to draw a circle and highlight a specific area. As of now, users are unable to change the marker location. Simply set draggable to true with the marker to enable that. Undrag and provides you with the updated location after the marker has been dragged. Instead of calling it value, change it to updated LED LNG. It is now possible to drag the marker anywhere on the map and place it wherever the user chooses. It is a simple plan. If the user drags a marker, it will check if the updated location falls within the selected area. In order to achieve that, we can use the Maps Toolkit package. You will find a Contains Location function after scrolling down a little bit. This function determines whether a given point falls inside a specified polygon. That's what we want. So let's add Maps Toolkit to our PubSpec YAML. Define a variable called is in the selected area which is true by default. It is necessary to import Map Toolkit as MP tool, otherwise it creates a conflict with Google Maps Flutter. Create a function called Checked Updated Location that requires point latitude longitude. Contains Location computes whether the given point lies inside the specified polygon. First to find the location point, we need to check which is updated latitude longitude and the area polygon points. Don't forget to wrap it. Under set state since the UI will update accordingly. It is called whenever a user's location changes. I have already created a custom component called address info, and I have set is in the delivery area to true. If we change it to false, it says the area is not accessible for delivery. Let's try changing the marker and see if it works. We're not getting the results we expected. Let's look into it. The reason for this is that Maps Toolkit has its own latitude and longitude. In order to solve it back to the function that we created, convert point latitude longitude. Also, the polygon points need to be converted. Here's another try. Let's see if it works as expected. Since we do not know the exact location, we have left it blank. Once you get the address, Pass it to the location field on the address info component. Check out the complete source code to see how I converted the points latitude and longitude coordinates to readable addresses. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to know how to draw routes and update user locations like Uber, this one might be of interest to you.